Uh, hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Inside Our Gaming. Welcome to another CCS event. Welcome to Oakford. Uh, sorry about the little bit of blank there. I completely forgot about the timer. Uh, wasn't looking at the time. Uh, so yeah, yeah. Anyways, welcome to Oakford. This is the uh, first CCS uh, on Oakford since it's been released. We are using uh, the line pack extra lines today, but I didn't get a line. I just got a normal 55. We're going up to wantage. That's what we'll be doing first. Good evening to the people out here. Uh, you're not going to hear any CCS events this evening because unfortunately the... Uh, PDP's microphone business has gone to crap, uh, so you won't be able to hear everyone else, which is a bit of a shame. Uh, hello to the people that are here, Solutions, B Dot, Cali, East Coast Gamer, uh, Kevin, good evening. Yeah, look, the old music was good. I was getting copyrighted on the old music, so I haven't found anything I like yet. So, um, yeah, basically all my streams in the past year have all been striped, uh, and I've had to sort them all out one by one. So I've got rid of the music, and yeah, I, I need to find some new music soon. Uh, I will do it. Okay, you're going to be surprised. Uh, we are in the Evo City, which you're all going to be thinking, why the frig is he driving this pile of crap? Uh, there was a mod posted earlier about the lights, so I thought, you know what, let's drive it and give it a go. And that's exactly what I've gone and done. Uh, oh my god, now we've got the old alerts as well. I'm not prepared for this, am I? Uh, one second, guys. Uh, but yeah, so there was a Evo City, London City patch that's been put up on Fellows Film. Uh, so I thought I'd give it a go and just see what it was like with the lights working and the indicators have been uh, turned down. Uh, Christopher Shields on Facebook, good evening, hello. There you go, I've just sorted them out. They should all be running nicely. Uh, oh. I don't know if anyone's going to get on this bus. I am using the Hanover one, but it doesn't like what we got. Right, let's pull into the- oh, people are going to get on. Okay, so, I don't know, I don't know what's going on. The Hoff is in, uh, showing on the display, and I'm okay with that. I just wanted to give the uh, bus a go, to be honest with you. Are people still going to ask for tickets? Oh, yeah. Nice and awkward, isn't it? Uh, you have to make a patch for it. Uh, okay, so there you go. Yeah, so the Hanover doesn't work with that patch, maybe. You're probably right. But look, people are still getting on. Um, but the good news is, the lights work, which is something. I might use the bus more now that it has the, 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 the mod there. Uh, we do have eight minutes before we go go. We can heat up our bus as well, which is what we want. I've turned all the lights on, everything else is pretty good, I think. Uh, I can't go on Fellow Film, so I need to pay $4.99 a month. What? Really? Um, YouTube has copyright free music. Now, my last song I used was actually copy free music. Um, I actually have to contest every single one of them, and then they give it back to me as not a strike, because yes, um, it is copy free. But something's changed with that music, uh, so I need to find a new song. I just don't know what yet, I've found anything yet. But yeah, we will. We will find something for sure. Jordan Crawford, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, it is very quiet while we're waiting. I will, I will get something together, right? I, I do promise. Okay, so we've got seven minutes before we drew out. In the old uh, Evo shitty. Causing a nice little queue there too. Uh, okay, so... Are we out at half past the hour? Alex, good evening, how are you? Uh oh. Taking a very long time, that worries me. I've broken it. I'll send you a pic of what it says. I had to do a two thing uh, authentication. That's all I had to do. It didn't say I had to pay anything. What were we doing? We're doing the 55 first. We are doing the 55 and uh, we actually are due out. We'll change this to miles per hour for you all. Um, okay. 
I'm good to go. So the indicator has been slowed right down with this mod and the lights work. So that's nice. Makes the bus a little bit better. Still not a perfect bus by any means, but it makes it a little bit more drivable. All we need now is B. You're kidding me. Is B dot to see if he can patch the Hanover for us, and uh, we'll be all good. Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. Not too bad. I'll have a look in a minute for you, uh, uh, Imran. I'll have a look. Nobody actually wants to get off it's because I've pressed F12. Very quiet stream today. I thought there'd be a few more around. What was my least favourite bus out of the London ones? Drive explains why I sold my company ones last month. Oh yeah, it's not. It's definitely the least favourite of the London. But like I said, with the uh, the little patch that was there, I thought I'd give it a go. With the lights working and stuff, it's not as bad as it was, you know. I take it for the odd trip in London, just for something different. Uh, Michael has a brand new line pack coming out very soon for Plimco Route 24. I think there's five extra lines he's done for that. Um, I will be covering it in the next day or two on the channel. So yeah, it'd be handy for something like that. We could do something there with this. I've been trying to repaint the left hand fleet. I thought I found a design I liked, but yeah, it's been a bit all over the place and uh, Dill sent me a few as well and I've just been trying to mix and match and trying to find something. I'm still just not sure. Uh, 
Uh, the line pack is out, yes, but I'm waiting for it to come on to BCS. I only drive BCS. If I don't make money for the company, what's the point of me driving? Unless it's a new map I'm covering or something. Um, I'll wait for it to come out in BCS. I'm sure it won't take too long. Yeah, no one really covers London as much, do they? It's too laggy. Everyone gets annoyed with it. Every time I record a video, it'd be like the last 30 seconds the bus will fall through the map or something stupid always happens when I record London stuff. I don't enjoy it that much. Pimco I've got no issue with, but the route is just too long for a video, really. I'd rather stream it, which I've done a few times. Uh, but the line pack, I'll be able to make a few extra videos now. <laughs> I don't think anyone likes The only time we do it is CCS. I don't mind it because, like I said, at least we're making money. But even the map doesn't make good money. For the runs that you do, it just makes absolute crap money. Like, I'd make more money in this 25-minute run than I would with a uh, 40-minute run in London, you know? That, that's the silly thing about it. To be fair, this bus ain't so bad with the patch now. So uh, B dot now needs to get get on a, a thing for me so I can make some uh, Pimpco uh, videos with the Hanover mod. Harrison's on the 59 here. Eh? Make sure you all hit that like button as well, guys. Help push my videos. Everything is important. It was you, was it? Yeah, I don't think there's too many people that are big fans of London. Oh, hello, Arjun. You're trying to get back to streams a lot more now. Yeah, no worries, you know. I, I get it. People have better things to be doing than sitting here watching me. Most of the people watching are probably actually just in the event and have me on in the background, I'd assume. So, <laughs> that's the reason why they're here. Uh, I was quite surprised by the amount of people that turned up yesterday for the uh, trucks, though. That was nice. It was a nice change, to be honest. Uh, next stop. Okay, I'll have a look next stop. Sugar! I wasn't, I wasn't looking, I was looking at something else. The old box and four wheels, yep. Yeah. Uh, it's had an update, well not an update, but someone's made a mod for the lights. So the lights now work. So it's not such a bad bus now. Oh yeah, there's a few of you that are always here, of course. Yeah, I can't afford not to have London buses, unfortunately, in my fleet. To be fair, London's still a popular map. There's quite a few people in the company that drive London still quite a bit. Okay, Imran wants me to have a look at this for him. Let's have a look. Where's my mouse? Uh, I can barely see that.
No, it's something to do with the ad blockers that you have on. You don't have to pay that four pounds. That's just them asking you to because you're not having adverts because you help them support them. Um, so you don't have to pay four pounds. Um, Sean Maxwell, good evening from a sunny Glasgow. It's a sunny island today too, eh? That map's never going to get fixed. I'd be surprised if we see an update, <laughs> you know. Don't get me wrong though, like the tubes and stuff, I love London. Um, trains, no problem, love London. It's just the London map's just too laggy, too many issues. The map itself is nice, if it just ran nicer, you know, it doesn't matter what you reduce, it's just still... I mean, compared to like some of these maps like this, where it's just so much smoother, 32 degrees tomorrow. I think we were about 27, 28 today, but we have a nice breeze here, you see, because we're on the coast, so it's not doesn't feel so hot. It's lovely. It's hot now. I'm upstairs and I'm in the roof and I'm doing this. The PC's giving off heat and all the lights on my face now, so I'm starting to sweat more now than I've sweated all day. Bakerloo, Piccadilly line. I like the trains on the Elizabeth line. When I was in England a few weeks ago, we went up to Ivor Heath's train station and I had a look at the, the new trains and stuff. They look quite nice, to be honest. What is the best map? Well, pff, I don't know. There's loads of really good maps. Yeah, Brixton is... It is a lag fest. It just makes it a bit unenjoyable when the screen's stuttering every like five minutes on well five seconds and then about five minutes. Yeah, I used to drive the buses up to South Hall and stuff, Arjun. I used to work for Slough first, didn't I? Uh, I used to go up there quite a bit. Just in general, anyways. But yeah, I used to live in Ivo, so... Is London the biggest map? Um, I don't think it's the biggest out of every map in OMSI. I'd say... Um, Allerheim is probably the, one of the biggest ones. It's hard to... It's hard, it's hard, I, can't, I don't really know, to be honest. When I went to Newcastle, saw one of my favourite trains, the 158. Nice. I like a 158 too, to be fair. Uh, Transport Productions, good evening. How are you, my friend? So we better start thinking now, what bus do you want me to drive next? Start thinking about putting some suggestions in. Uh, Tim, good evening. Guy's got cash. Give me your money.
So on my Extra Lines video, this is where we came up to the other day. Uh, that I posted, was it yesterday or the day before? Hanley? Or Hanny? Is it Hanny? Hanny? Gonna hit that curb? No. Gonna crash into the car? Yep. Okay, Hanny Pub. Sunday I'm going to Leeds bus running day uh, with Prince, nice. I, I don't know what the oldest bus is. Um, it's actually set up in Jonathan's name tonight, so uh, none of the company buses are there, so I can pick whatever I want. This bus stop makes no sense to me. I think this village really only needs one bus stop. We'll do a veiling. That's what people want. I don't think I have that thing installed anymore. Shame that the event we can't hear anyone. So you're gonna get on? Go for a B7 first, then we might do a streetlight afterwards. Then, uh, how's your noise, mate? Catch you after dinner.
Uh, Richard Cliff, any semi-naked people get on the bus with the hot weather? Fortunately not. To be fair, I forgot to put my humans pack in here, I think, as well. So I've only got the default people. Something I need to remember is to add humans to this map. Yeah, the voice chat not working on the on, on it's a bit crap. But good evening, Prince. Uh, going big good evening. How are you? Is the bus fixed? What do you call fixed? Is it still the same bus? Yeah, but basically the lights at the front work. Um, and the indicator's a bit slower, that's it. Uh, would you play on to 2 if it got a graphics update? The graphics from the bus in 22. Um, as long as it didn't lose its style of how it drives. I don't mind Bus in 22. Is it, it's not great, but it's not that bad either. So no, we've got a huge problem here. Um, <laughs> I think the game broke. We'll blame the bus. We'll give it a little bit longer. Yeah. Good old Omzi. Also means I'm going to lose the run completely. Uh, well, that was a waste of half an hour of my time, wasn't it? Nice. All I needed. Okay. See if it'll load me back in. Sometimes it loads you straight back in. We'll give it a minute. Do 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 do. Yeah, it's annoying. I love the new livery in Yorkshire by the Phantom. I haven't seen it yet. OMSI takes for bloody ever to load now as well. Just try and see if anything new's happened anywhere. We can go into the Discord chat and see what rubbish everyone is talking about. Well, probably only buy me a, a shot glass <laughs> over here because of the prices of points now over here. Or a fight a fiver actually would get you probably about ten miles in fuel in a car. With the current fuel prices. That is true, yeah. Well at least in Ireland now it's uh the fuel prices are starting to drop. 
They're, they're starting to drop a little bit. It's, it, some Interesting conversation, eh? Charging one eighty nine a litre. That's out of eyes for me. What? What? When? Why? Have a look at the repaint section. Okay. Five, can, I, can I get next tour, please? All the drivers are in a Discord can chat. We've just gone into that's this. Still available. What are you, are you on now? I've just finished a fifty-five and ended up in Oakford. Name's Deckard. Yeah. What is that? Fifty-five. Yeah. And he think? Don't tell me. Oh mm. my god, that was a perfect score somehow. Okay, well that was interesting for the whole 30 seconds. Uh, so it should load us back in where we were. <laughs> uh, was the bus fixed because you were using the Hanover one? I am using the Hanover one. The Hanover won't work. Uh, B dot needs to do a little patch on it because whatever they've changed has probably broken his mod. Uh, so I haven't got any destination screens, but people are getting on. So that was something. Yeah, good old Omzi. But yeah, that was an interesting conversation on it. Fuel prices. <laughs> so all the drivers normally we have a uh, chat for uh the ccs events but for some reason it's not working tonight so they're all sitting there together talking away i couldn't drive and listen to all of them especially that dub oh omzi you serious pain in the ass Jordan, have I installed TS tools? Yeah, why? Okay, I just gotta... Uh, the schedule's still set. Yeah, there's something wrong with it, with the mod. So the destination isn't working there. But yeah, the lights now work. So I've got on or off though. Alright, anyways, let's get out of it. We'll pretend nothing happened. Nothing happened there. <laughs> yeah, just another day in the office. I can do reskins for train simulator. Ah, uh, nah, I'm, I'm not that crazy into making skins. We can see Simply Prince. He's uh, he's around. He's on the mini map, driving around. I need to move my uh, thing here too, don't I? Uh, I don't know where it's got to go. Oh, Prince is doing the ninety. Makes sense.
Last drive yesterday on the 20 to Bolton told us about the street decks with a new engine costing 60 grand. With each seat costing four grand. Yeah, it could be possible. Well, the engine wise anyways, I don't know about the seats. Four grand a seat seems a bit OTT, but. Bloody door is open. I think my front doors are broken. If you haven't done my scenario, can you also add the class one eighty Grand Central? Uh, I well. It's not finished finished, but I'll be, I was adding some more AI today. It's not far from being finished. Um, but yeah, I can do it. Okay, so the front door of my bus is broken, but we're at our last stop. Oh, the game's gone again. Are you serious? I'm blaming the bus. It's bloody lucky. I don't know, this map's never crashed on me since I've played it. This is the first, that was the first time I've had a game crash. There isn't so something does, there was a warning with the bus when I tried to pick the map, so I'm, I'm assuming it's because I've gone for the Hanover, but that new mod for the lights has broken the Hanover. Could be causing some conflicts. Uh, Diesel Car Rail Sim, have you tried it yet? I haven't tried it yet. Someone has told me about it a few times. Um, I will. I will have a look at it. I've got some other train games there that I haven't even looked at yet. Look at my door. It's proper broken. Hey! Look at this guy just coming out of the bus. Nice. Alright. Terminate this tour. I'm not using that bus again. Uh, will, hello. You're going to Turkey tomorrow. Nice. They didn't like my driving, did they? But the main thing was we got paid. I think I need to go and find out who is in the office. So we're going to, have to go back into that Discord. Who's in the Thanks. office? Stop it inside. Who's in the office? Um, uh, can you set me a new route, please? Mac is inside. I'm in the office as well. Yeah. I need perms for a bus as I well, please. I've got to bring my bus back to the depot because of that repair. Yeah. So what do I do? Just um, take out another one, I suppose, yeah? Well, you should be able to finish the tour and then send it back. Yeah, I'll finish the tour, yeah. Yeah, then you can get a new route. I've just worked out how to find ticket inspector. Huh. Mac, can I get an ambulance, please? Yeah, we're doing it, son, too. And... Screw you all. And it's in main road. Main road, all right. Screw the dub. <laughs> the main road, you said. Yeah, your next stop, yeah, because I'm a minute and a half early. Four minutes. 
Yeah, lovely. Cheers. So yeah, he's just helping Gary instead of giving me a route. I still don't have a route or permissions. We'll give him a second. Oh, Benidorm, nice. Am I getting a tour war? What's going on here? Are you uh, setting me a tour? Yeah, what do you want? I, I don't mind. Sure. And I need permissions for a bus as well, please. Mm hmm. You want a 22? Uh, no, too early. Yeah, I just need something that's about ten minutes from now, so like twenty past one or after. Yeah. Twenty-five past for twenty-four. That'll do. And you should have permission to him. Thank you. Cheers. Come on, Mac, cheer up. Jesus. Uh, I'm off to a strip club on Saturday. No, why not? I remember the first time I, I went to a strip club. It was my 18th, and it was a football club Christmas party. And uh, my dad came with the football club as well because uh, we used to live in a pub, and he sponsored the football team, and he took me into my first strip club. Oh, I don't have perms. We need to go back into this Discord again. The next one, please. Yeah, we're doing that from. Uh, just follow on the same tour. It's circular. Yeah, let me find you. I also need perms for a bus afterwards, please. Also, yeah. Have, yeah. I should have given you them. Yeah, the mic not working on CCS is an absolute pain in the balls here. There we go. Uh, it was the veiling people wanted me to drive, wasn't it? It's down here somewhere. Where are you on this list? Uh, an eco map, wasn't it? Which one's this? Okay, well, we'll, we'll just take this one then. Did I leave that Discord? I did. Uh, hopefully, in your favorite plane is 737. You go with Ryanair or something, I. Right? Okay, let's take this bad boy. We're going to go for an eco map. We've got an E4 gasket here. We'll take this one. Okay, what's our starting point? What are we actually doing? I'm doing the line 24. Wantage to wantage. I assume it's going to be at the marketplace. Kings Grove. Okie dokie. Uh, what bus did we take? We need uh, Oakford. MS Hoff, isn't it? Yeah. Boom. Off we go. Ah, uh, yeah, you'd be in a 747. 
Oh, always waiting. Uh, Sean, that's terrible. I didn't. I didn't hear nothing. Nothing was on our news about it today. Well, it wasn't earlier, did it? Unless it happened after five o'clock. Yeah, I, I don't have BBC News, so I only get whatever we get. Okay. I've not done the 24 yet, I don't think. Do you remember that you did a long live? Uh, when was that? Uh, what are we doing then? So we're doing line 24 now. Uh, tour 1, 1325. Okay, that's good with me. Let's start getting this bus on. It takes a while to turn on. Okay, so the bus is on. Uh, what are we doing? We're doing a 24, which is a town service. Okay, drive number 692 pin 3922104. Route 24, journey 1, uh, we're going out I suppose, there we go, perfect. Okay, lights on, bus lights on, bus into drive. Sort ourselves out. Glasgow will be 28 degrees tomorrow. Yeah, it's supposed to get warmer and warmer now every day, isn't it?
Okay, hang on. I don't have my bus stops, so I have no idea. There we go. Okay, so this is a circular. <laughs> I'm in the bus stop. Good place to be. Thirteen twenty eight in it. I go. It was twenty five past them even. No, I can't go back in time. <laughs> okay. We were leaving three minutes late. What a muppet. Uh, it's because there wasn't enough air compressed uh, in in the uh, tanks, so the bus kind of leaves the brakes on. So I wasn't moving very well, that was all. Just wonder. No. Ladies, no. Yay, we've got some passengers.
Bit of a sneaky bus stop behind that. Uh, can the bus break down? Yeah. My bus broke down on the last run. The doors broke on the last stop. I just didn't bother uh, fixing it. We're walking through the bus. Nice. To be fair, our prices are the same for whatever stop you go to, no matter how long or how far. So, to be honest with you, I never, you signed in in the morning, I just left it on the first run, I never changed it. There was never any need. You're just selling the same ticket all day, so it didn't matter. Could be similar. So you think of buying Train Some Wealth through and it comes out? I'm not so sure myself. Feels a bit of a cash grab, what they are doing. Don't get a core update. Ah, oh, it's a tough one, isn't it? I might not get it instantly. Um, I might wait and see what routes they um, are going to bring next, and then maybe I'll think about it. But just for the extra 40 miles for me, it, it's not worth it. I know there's better weather. 3d clouds but i can live without them to be honest with you and something about train wheels moving i mean i don't really drive trains and look at the wheels anyway so i'm not fussed about that uh, so yeah i'll probably hold off depending obviously when they next release the uk route we'll have no choice because it won't be for train sim world 2 um but at the moment no because why do i want to pay for deluxe for the spirit of steam that i've already paid for once and i've barely played and the Ashford line that, you know, it's just got an extension. At the moment, I don't need that. So until a UK line is probably announced, I probably won't. But we'll see. We'll, we'll take it as it is nearer the 6th of September. Why do they walk through the bus? It's just sometimes how, how, how it is. The people, the pathing and stuff. Just, just the way it is. Some buses do it more than others.
Uh, when do you think Akala's gonna come? I don't know. I've not heard anything about Akala in a while. I'd be more excited about the Renown. We're gonna get probably get the Renown next, I'd imagine. I agree with you. Uh, just can't for life me understand why they've extended the UK route. Maybe they will come. Maybe. Yeah, so for me, I can hang on a little bit. I'd be quite happy to wait till the next UK route is released because obviously, like I said, it'll only be released on Trains in World 3. So, you, you know, eventually I'll get no choice, but I'm not in a, an initial rush to go out my way and pre order it now. No, just for a bit better lighting. I mean, the quality I, I stream in is pretty crap anyways. Uh, you guys probably won't even notice. <laughs> so, uh, for me, it's it's not the be-all and end-all right now. Now, if there was something like multiplayer or something, you know, something that would have been a little bit different, I would have been all in for sure. But, uh, yeah. Bit let down yesterday, I think. And the thing was, they said that they were going to be on location and then they were flying out. I mean, what, what, was he in a German office or something? Is that where he was? Like, to me, that made no sense. I thought they were going to be, like, filming it maybe outside on a railway somewhere. What they were covering, I don't know. He was just in an office. Like, he could have been in Chatham for we know. And he didn't exactly seem particularly happy to be there, did he? I don't know. I don't know. Like I said, for me, I felt a bit disappointed. I thought there was going to be a lot more. Um, you know, dynamic weather. They could have easily put it into Train Sim World 2. They could have updated the core. And um, to be honest with you, I don't understand why we never had dynamic weather. So. Who knows? Who knows? Hey, Kurt, how are you? Yeah, the Renown does look good. Hopefully we'll see it soon, eh? Uh, so not been around very much. Currently melting, yeah. <laughs> I think everybody's melting a bit. It's not so bad here compared to the UK, but it's still warm. You coming on, love? Uh, I think I'm taking a left hit. Uh, it's a bit of a letdown. Don't know whether lightning looks good. Yeah, why not just update? Oh, forget. We're gonna have to go through the cars. They're not gonna move now. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. Like, I thought what they did was really cool by giving us all these clues in the. Um, but the fact that they were extensions and not full-on routes. Yeah, you know. I think if they're going to bring out something as big as Trains in World 3, why not bring three new routes to the table for everybody? That would have made people go out and definitely get it, you know what I mean? Well, right away. I'm sure loads of people will get it anyways. Um, but yeah, I, I, I don't know. It's a bit weird, wouldn't it? I mean, if they gave us, like, an updated editor for scenarios, because the one that's currently there, it's okay, but it's not great at the same time. Or even a map ed editor. Imagine giving us a map editor to build our own maps. I don't think we're ever going to get that with Trains in World, but imagine if we could start making fictional routes or other people could start making routes. But they're not going to do it because, you know, it keeps the money in. Once you start letting, like, Armstrong or Alan Thompson or Vulcan or any of these guys start making routes and maps, 
the money just starts going out the window, doesn't it? So I don't think they'll ever allow it. Unless you're assigned with them. I don't think we'll ever get to do that stuff. Uh, Imran's gonna go make some money. Nice. Off you go then. <laughs> I'll catch you later. Thank you for stopping by. I mean, look, people that live in that area are probably really happy that it's been extended. But it's probably one of my least favorite routes. I play it the least since I've had it. I've, I might have driven on it twice. Maybe I'll drive it more. I don't know. You see, I, I just don't know. So it's, it's a real tough one. And what they did, I think the worst thing was they did all that big build up, which I thought was quite smart how they put the clues out and the picture was all three routes kind of mangled together, which was always going to be obvious. Um, and then they come up with what they did. I don't know. I can't even drive now. Even if they just gave us like a new steam train locomotive or something, I would have probably would have been fair enough. Yeah, I don't know. Obviously, this is where they want to go going forward. But what worries me is they'll bring out five, six routes, and then they're going to sell. We want to go to Train Sim World Four, and we're going to pay again. And I just, I just don't know. I don't, I, I don't know. I mean, look how you know, Snowrunner's done it, or ETS, ATS, DLCs, season passes. I don't mind that kind of thing. I'll, I'll pay for, like, that kind of thing if you want to call it that. I've got no issues with it, and I'd happily pay, but... You know, that, that's where they have to be going, Kevin. If they don't start making routes like that that people really want, like, on the main lines then uh you know people are gonna lose love with it quite quickly like i said there's apart from rivet there's not exactly many um many third party developers allowed with train sim yet the train sim world so no one's gonna be creating routes apart from them people so yeah i don't know we'll see it might surprise us yet it might it might end up being worth it we can only have fingers crossed and hope for the best. Oh, Max is hit. Okay, uh, what we'll do, we'll do one more of the same route just to make it easy tonight and I'll call it a day. Hang on, we need to go back into this Discord. Yeah, Mac, can you give us a, a short one? Huh? A short four. Yeah.
except for the 88 i 87 that yeah. was just senseless yeah doesn't matter where it goes from no it doesn't matter where one they can respawn At all. No. What about a 23 from Eightford High Street? Uh, how many minutes is it? 15. Yeah, I can start yeah. Should have it now. Uh, Mac, I need another route. Can I get the same route again? The 24. That should be the next one on the on the list. Yeah. Well, you're not allowed, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> 24. Should have it now. Cheers. Okay, so we're back now doing the same run again. And I'm okay with that. That was a nice little run actually, I quite liked it. 1350. We shouldn't have to change anything here. No one's getting on. Clearly you don't like where my bus is. We'll see if we can make these people happier. All the way down the end. Oh, love, in you get. Haha, <laughs> no cash as well. Happy days. God, my paint is done badly, eh? Okay, so we've got a couple of minutes to wait, we might as well just wait for them. Yeah, cashless would be better, and what I say is because of driver safety, and it's the same thing here in Ireland. Sometimes, you know, on a busy day, I can have a thousand or plus cash on me, and people know that. And when you're late night coming in, say, out of Dublin or stuff, and people wait for drivers. There have been so many attacks and incidents. Uh, cashless is definitely the way forward. It, you know, everyone should be cashless. Uh, like I said, people know we're carrying tons of money. I have to go on a lunch break for, say, an hour and a half, sometimes around the town in the evenings. Nine o'clock, it's dark. I could be walking up and down from the station, it's quiet. People know, they know the, the bus area and bags and they know what we're carrying in it. They all know that we've got our cash in there. So yeah, for me, cashless is the only way. Cashless should have been in a long time ago. Long time ago, in my opinion. Yeah, thank you for reminding me that Man United is a pile of shite. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I already know. I watched the game. It was dreadful. To be honest with you, I didn't understand. I know he had no other striker, but I would have played it differently how he did. 
I think Fernandez needs to be taken off the team. Ericsson played well, I thought, when he came deep. But we had no attacking option, and that was the problem. Rashford should have scored probably about three or four. But he's just got no form. He needs he needs to score. He needs confidence. He needs to get, get through a good run of games and hope he gets a couple of goals. That's what we desperately need to try and boost him again. But even Sancho was missing for the whole game. We played through the middle. We had no striker. So there was no, you know, we got it, we got we got the width and it was out in the wings, but there was no one in the box. Yeah, we were we were bad. We need a striker badly. Um, we missed out on Sesco. We've missed out on uh, so many so many strikers. This, and I, I mean, we could do with a central midfielder, a good strong one too, uh, because Fred and McTominay are not good enough to be in. A, but McTominay especially lost the ball. I think it was like twenty four times in that game. Uh, he is not good enough to play in the Man United midfield. He just isn't good enough. Fred isn't too bad. But both of them together, no. Um, but McTominay was a huge weak link. Massive weak link. I would have taken McTominay out of the team, had Ericsson playing in that kind of floating middle role, let Fred be the defender midfield. Bruno could have played where he usually plays as the false nine, and then you could have had Ronaldo on. But anyways, it doesn't matter. Let's not talk about Man United because it's depressing. We got Brentford on the weekend, and they're probably going to smash us too, so. We need a midfielder, and we need a striker, and we need one soon. Because we're not rebuilding United. They're doing the same thing as they've done to all the managers. They're not giving them the manager the backing. Ten Hag could be a good manager, but Man United, it's just like Mourinho. Great manager. Look what he's doing at Roma. It's just the United, the, the back room is just poison at the moment, and... All, all the Glazers are worried about is how much money are they putting back into their pockets. Yeah, McFred are definitely no good, mate. Uh, City lad. <laughs> oh, God, City lad. Hope you're not a Man City lad. But yeah, look, just watching them two in the middle is dreadful. It's so poor. Um, McTominay especially, I think. He had, he had a good kind of season there two seasons ago. But he's, he just hasn't got it. He, he's, he's not... He's not Man United material, that's for sure. So we need, you know, if Frankie de Jong is coming, he needs, they need to get this sorted now. Like this Barcelona saga, I mean, they can't even register their players. They spent all this money on their players, but they won't give him his money that he's owed. And that's the big problem here. But he'll probably go to Chelsea. Uh, it wouldn't surprise me. And now we're looking around to try and find somebody else. But we needed these players in before the season started. Bring them in now. Two or three weeks in, they're not got fitness enough, or you know they, they haven't had enough time to train with the new players. It's it, it's it's a tough ask for them to come in and say they're going to change the game because they're not. You know they're not going to gel. It's going to take weeks, months even. Uh, so not getting them early is, is a big shame. Big shame. But we need a striker too. Look, Ronaldo's fine, but he's still not 100% fit. Could get injured and go off sulking for a couple of weeks. You don't know what's going on. Does he really want to play for United right now? Probably not. Ugh, there's so many ifs and buts. We need... Martial isn't good enough either. Um, we need a striker. We need somebody. I don't know who they're going to go for or what they're going to do. To be honest with you, I would nearly go for at this stage of the transfer window is someone that's already Premier League hardened. You know, why not go for that guy that's playing at Fulham? Uh, I can never remember his name. Mitrovic or whatever his name is. Two seasons ago in the Premier League, he scored tons. Championship, he scored tons. He's used to the league now. I'd go after him. You'd probably get him out of Fulham's hand for 25 million, 30 million. But we need someone that's season hardened in the Premier League now for this late stage of, the, of this, the transfer window. No point in getting somebody in from Europe because, as we've proven, you know, you bring in some of these players like Sancho. Yeah, he was a world star at Borussia Dortmund, but he was playing in a, a league that has two good teams, possibly three. And it's just not the same. The intensity of the Premier League, it doesn't matter who you play from Brentford to Arsenal to Man City, the intensity is. It's a whole different league compared to any of those other leagues. I mean, look at 
Timo Wiener at Chelsea. I know he's gone now and he's gone back to the Germans League, the Farmers League, where he'll score 30 goals this season. You watch. Couldn't do it. Couldn't, you know. I don't know. United need to do something, though. I just want to be woken up with good news for a change, but I just don't see it happening. <laughs> Ran over. Give me your money. Sorry, love. No, you didn't see you behind the tree. Did you hear about Dexter Loomis got arrested? You know about WWE? I, I haven't even seen Raw this week or anything, mate. I have no idea. Mo is USA. What was that? Uh, do you think you could play one poker game and junk out a truck only one round? Yeah, I can do. But my problem is, is I know to cheat now. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll do it. Like, I didn't do a video today. Um, it'll be back again tomorrow. And uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, have, I'll have a good look. I need to make some money. I'm hoping the new moonshine is going to get me some uh, money because I'm desperate. It can happen in real life, but if you know it's going to work every time. Look, I, I will play one round of poker. I, I will. We might do it tomorrow. If not, it'll be the day after. What's my favorite game? I don't really have a favorite game. I love my flight simulators, but I am learning to fly, so, you know, something that really interests me. But look, I'm a bus driver in real life. You know, I'm driving buses. I play anything that I just enjoy. I started playing at uh, Fatal Frontier today. Really enjoyed that, City Builder. You got money from the scratch card. Five grand. I've never won anything else than a tenner. I might just buy tons of them until we win some money. I think eventually I have to give me money, right? How many tickets did you have to buy?
Uh, you just started playing Euro Truck 2, good game. Yeah, we did a convoy last night on American Truck last night. Um, I do have a virtual trucking company, City Lad. I don't know if you're in the Discord or not. Uh, where you, you basically collect miles for the company. I prefer ATS myself, American Truck, but, uh, you know. Did you watch Inside the Factory this week, building new London buses in Scarborough? No, it's recorded. I might even watch it tonight. It would be tonight or tomorrow anyways, for sure. Was it good? Is it worth a watch? Or are you going to tell me they literally showed nothing? Because some of them, I, I've recorded the whole series, some of them have been good, some of them have been a bit naff as well. Okay, people getting out. Okay, uh, yeah, I think it's a level thing. Does an hour buying ticket after a while. Don't get less than 50, then once in a while you hit big. Ah, nice, okay. I'm gonna have a good look at that then as well. You don't like Greg Wallace? Is that his name, Greg Wallace? He does the Master Chef. I think he's alright. He's alright. Uh, see you later, gotta go mate, keep the good work. No worries mate, see you later. Like I said, if you want to uh, join us in any uh, trucking stuff, do come join Discord. Same for anyone that might be new here, that's watching. Why not come join Discord? Virtual airlines, virtual trucks, virtual buses, I don't know what else I do. What else do we do? Anyone else know? gonna do a 5m stream I haven't done one in a while basically what happened to my server was we had a group group of like 20 to 30 people um, and they all fell out over absolutely nothing and it destroyed my server that's why I haven't been on it I've been very lazy whoa where's that bus going um... That's interesting. He's going for a... He's going the long way around that roundabout, isn't he? <laughs> God, I've got to go behind this guy now. Um, but yeah, I do plan to go back into the 5M. What I need is like three or four people to help me rebuild. I can't do it on my own because I can't be on it enough but if i can find two or three people that are really interested on rebuilding the 5m situation with me um i'd bring it back Um, I played my garage. I've done a season on it. It's had a lot of updates now. I must admit, I need to go back and play properly. Um, but yeah, I played a lot of my garage. There is a uh, there is a playlist when it first came out. It had loads of bugs back then though. But uh, yeah, King Slayer is your favourite map at the moment. Yeah, Oathford's nice. I like Oathford. I like the line packs as well. This twenty four is nice. I've actually quite enjoyed this twenty four.
Uh, Mud Mose, are you in the Discord? Come talk to me in the Discord, and uh, I'll sort it out properly. But basically, yeah, look, my server has everything in everything, but I need a few people to help me rebuild. Like I said, all the other guys, unfortunately, just fell out over nothing. There are still people playing in it, but obviously I'm not streaming in it as much and stuff, so, you know, it just goes out the window a little bit. Yeah, I played a little bit of the new update. I haven't played loads, I must admit. I need to go back to it. I know there's been new vehicles and new parts, and I've seen I've seen all the updates. I, I will go back to my garage. To be fair, I don't think I'm too far from finishing junkyard mechanic, uh, junkyard truck for a while. Um, we're not far off doing everything. Once everything's done, until there's a big update, we'll be we'll be done with that. Our oh, ducks there. Right, love. Yeah, we need the renown. SP used to watch some of my streams. He's disappeared. this guy come on come on you want to pay in cash sit your ass down I don't think renown be too long now did you see minions the rise of Gru uh, no Uh, I don't have an RC car, no.
Oh, nice. Yeah, like I said, I don't think it'll be too far away now. A couple of weeks, maybe. Be nice, maybe end of August, end of September, latest. Be nice if we get the renown. Be a nice little kind of early Christmas present, wouldn't it? Uh, I've done a vlog before in uh, my classic car that I own, in my Mini. Uh, I do have a vlog coming up with Max the dog. Um, but that's a secret. I'm not telling anyone about what that is until I've done it. Um, but that will be here in the next kind of two weeks. Um, I've actually got some footage of me flying that I was supposed to have put up that I haven't done still. Uh, and I need to do that actually because I need to clear the footage because I'm flying again next week. So... Um, yeah, I've done a few vlogs. Okay, that is the end of us. Another nice little run. Take the money. Okay, another two grand. Back to the office. Uh, yeah, so there we go guys. I'm gonna call that it for tonight. Thank you to all the mods and members Thank you to everyone that took part as always uh, people in the office uh, People have set it up people that have been driving tonight. There's been quite a few of you. Thank you all so much for the continued support um, yeah, No worries, he's gonna go play my summer car. Thank you to everyone there in the chat I won't go for all the names because so many of you uh, but big thanks as always, you know to people like Kevin Graham, Curtis Hard, uh, Sean Imran, Harrison, Gary, you know, B dot, you guys, uh, mud mowers, all you lot for your support pretty much every night of the week. So thank you all so, so much. And hopefully I will see you soon. Bye for now.